Hello, this is Pam Sherrett with Ohio State. It's August 16th, it's about 83 degrees for the high today. This is 5 8 ryegrass grown on a sand root zone. You can see we've got some severe physiological stress going on right now. There is no evidence of disease, no spores, no active fungi on here. This is a physiological response. Uh, we've had very high temperatures and humidity this summer. And just this week we've had ET rates go back up to probably 0.2 or 0.25 inches a day. So the turf grass plants are transpiring with very little roots and I think we think this is causing just uh, plant collapse and plant death. Some of these ryegrass cultivars are doing much better than others. This is one that seems to be doing okay so far. Uh, this is one obviously that not, not doing so well in the heat with these high ET rates. Um, so this is where we are right now. It's obviously a bigger problem on golf course greens than it is on sports turf. But even on sports turf with these low cut rise that are under stress, uh, these high ET rates at the end of this hot summer are really aren't helping.